what is going on guys? This is the April 2022 parts hunt. Before I go get those parts, I came to Bunsen Park in BC for a hike. It's about like, I think six kilometers. So about like two hours worth of hike. It's uh, really good for your hygiene. So you guys should definitely do it too. But anyways, after that, I'll be getting a kit of 16 gigabytes DDR4 clock at 2133 for 50 bucks. And after that, I'm gonna get a Ryzen 5 3600X for 160, which is a pretty good deal. On top of that, I also ordered a $70 B365M motherboard. Planning to use it with a laptop i9 chip thing. I'll pair that up with a 1080, so I gotta look around for it. So I'll see you guys when I go get those parts. So I just picked up this VTX 1080 for $330. He sent me a video of it. It should be working 100%. On the way to uh, here, I also talked to a guy who's selling a GTX 760 and I got him down to $50. So I'm gonna go pick out that right now. Okay guys, so I just picked up this GTX 760 graphics card. As you can see, it says 760 somewhere here. You can't really see the reflection. But yeah, for some reason this guy has it sealed in one of these like food bag thingies. I don't know, it's like it's like completely sealed. It's no opening, so I have to cut it open when I get home. But yeah, I'm gonna use this for one of my budget flips because people on Facebook keep on asking me if I have cheaper options. So there they go. Ooh. Okay guys, so I just came back from uh, picking up the last part for today, which is 16 gigabytes of DDR4 clock at 21.33 megahertz. And so after today, I have one deal lined up, which I need to wait for the guy to come back from the island. So I'll pick it up in the next few days, which is a system for $300, has a Ryzen 3 2300X, it has a RX 560. A <laughs> Finally! 600 watt power supply, 500 gigabyte SSD, and a case with some RGB, so I could buy that. So that's one of the deals. And uh, tomorrow or Monday, I'm gonna go pick up i5 Force Gen combo, which has 16 gigabytes of RAM and that MATX motherboard. So I'll see you guys then when I go pick up those deals. Okay guys, so I ended up not getting that motherboard i5 combo because I messaged him and he never responded and I stood outside for like 40 minutes so fuck this deal. I'll just go get a different deal which will save me around $55 and it's actually closer to me too. It's gonna be a i7-4790 system with a MATX motherboard. It'll still be perfect for the case I chose to buy earlier today which is the uh, Matrix 30. <laughs> So I just came back from getting this PC and this guy, he had a Master Box NR200 from Cooler Master. It's like a white ITX case. And since it's the only 200, he also gave me this tempered glass side panel, which is from like a 200P, which he said should be compatible. So your boy is finally going to build an ITX PC on the channel. Although it might take a while because I need a... Oh, I need a get those parts individually slowly because ITX parts are really expensive. Okay guys, so it is Friday, a day before I go get the CPUs. I managed to pick up this RX 474GB MSI edition for just $100, which is a pretty sweet deal. So literally 8 hours later, this guy delivered 10 hard drives, which is like $30 each, and all of them all says around like 1 to 2 hours of usage. Okay guys, so I just came back from picking up this $300 system. You can see it's a little bit dusty, but uh, that's an ugly cooler. But look at this, RGB fans, and then there's a RX 560. Ah, uh, it's only a 2 gigabyte, but it should still handle 1080p low. Perfectly fine. And <laughs> this is an OEM by the design of this power button, the Fantex case. And on top of that, my dealer decided to drop off four of these to me instead. So I didn't have to go pick up, so he just dropped it off this morning. 
35 bucks each. Tomorrow is the last deal. So I'll see you guys there. Alrighty guys, so here's the Ryzen CPU. He packed it. There shouldn't be any bend pins, but if there are, I could just fix it really quickly. And the i9, he just he uh, tested it and stuff. It's working absolutely fine. So I'll be using this in one of my upcoming videos. Okay guys, to end off the parts hunt, I am now going to get a GTX 670 4GB for just $80. It's only 5 minutes drive so it's perfect. I'm going to use it with the Ryzen 3 2300 XPC because the RX 560 is just complete garbage. So yeah, let's go to it. Okay guys, so I just got home and time to install the graphics card and see if it's working. And now for the moment of truth. Oh, forgot to flip the power switch. Okay, okay. Keep us lighting up. And we should. Oh, okay. Okay. It booted. Okay, I got scared for a second, but I just clicked the reset switch. And it looks like it's booting up fine. I think the first time it didn't boot up is because the AMD driver, so it's gonna quickly DDU it. And it should be good to go. So while I am running a Unigen Heaven test to see if this card is 100% functional, this is the end of the 2022 April parts hunt. And I gotta say, this is one of my favorite months for part time considering all the GPU deals and all the PC deals I pick up this month. So comment down below on which is your favorite deal for this month's video. And if you liked the video, or enjoyed it at least, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to your channel. If you didn't, still give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to your channel because you want to spread that positivity. And I'll see you guys next month.